Now, correspondent question. First, I'll read the question. Consider 52 kg mountain climber. That is mountain climber. Height mass is 52 kg. Okay. So, in below, find the tension in rope. Okay. So, find our motto. Determine tension in the rope. That is rope. So, determine T. Okay. And the force that mountain climber must exert with her feet on that vertical rope, rope phase, rock phase to remain stationary. That is F. Okay. The whole system is re remain stationary. Okay. It means equilibrium condition. Assume that the force is exerted parallel to her leg. This is parallel to her leg. Also assume neglecting force exerted by arm. Okay. And what is the minimum coefficient of friction between her shoes and cliff? That is mu also. So our motto determine capital T, F and mu. So clear or not? What is our motto? Determine in equilibrium condition. What is what tension in the rope? And what about force F? Okay. And also coefficient of friction between cliff and shoes or shoes. Okay. So first of all, make free by diagram of each block. Okay. Now see if you see weight mg downward. If you this one like that one, that is also 31. Sorry, not 31. That is 15 degree simply 15 degree this one is 15 so that is also 15 and now a vertical line that one if that one 31 degree that is also 31 okay so make free by diagram very carefully okay that is f so this one is written as capital f okay here tension T, here weight mg downward, okay, and that angle is how much 15 degree, and that is 31, okay. Here T cos 31, here T sin 31, okay, here F cos 31, sorry, 15 degree, and here F sin 15 degree, clear or not. Clear or not? Let for simplicity point of G this be equal to 10 meter per second square. So mass is 52 and G is 10. So that one is 520. Otherwise, you can also take in if you simplicity not you have considered 9.8 because of I have solved with the LC. So simply you can 9.8. Okay. Now vertical vertical balance the whole system in equilibrium so you can say that t sine 31 this is equal to f cos 15 degree so you can say that what about t t is written as f cos 15 divided by sine 31 so f cos 15 cos 15 is with the help of calculator cos 15 calci that is how much 0 0.965 whole divided by sine 31 that is how much 0 0.515 okay now 0.965 divided by 0.515 5 we got how much 1. 1.1.873 f that is capital t equation number one now the whole system in oh, it, it, here also written as f of x is zero and here if you end out f of y is zero because of net force is zero on the climber okay mountain climber so also f of y is also zeros in vertical direction so you can say that t cos 
31 plus f sin 15 this will be equal to mg mg is 52 into 9.8 so if put here t 1.73 f into cos 31 into f okay plus f sin 15 this will be equal to how much 52 into 9.8 so f in bracket cos cos 31 cos 31 is how much that is 0 0.857 and here 1.873 plus sin 15 sin 15 is sin 15 is how much that is 0 0.258 this be equal to 52.98 okay so what about f 52 into 9.8 divided by now 0.857 into 1.873 that is like that one plus 0.258 we got 1.1.863 okay so so after that 52 into 9.8 like that one divided by 1.863 that is how much 2 point that is we got 273.53 newton okay now if this value put in so we got f f is 1.873 into 273.53 okay that is multiply by multiply by 1.8 seven three then we got what about t that is five point one two three sorry five three three newton clear or not so finally we got f is two seven three point five three newton and capital F is 512.33 Newton. Okay, that is answer part A. Clear or not? Simply, <coughs> in equilibrium condition, component of T, component of F in vertical and horizontal direction. After solving, we got like that one. Clear or not? <coughs>